Ladies and gentlemen, we are here at Black Friday's trade show and networking event hosted by All Black Market. I'm here with Dale. Dale, how are you doing, man? I'm good. I'm good. Always glad to be here in these environments <laughs> supporting everybody. So it's just good. Of course, of course. So you're one of the vendors here today. So just quickly, about 30 seconds, tell me about what your business is and what you'll be selling. Okay, absolutely. So our business focuses on community building, financial literacy, generational wealth. So we have a podcasting component and we do networking events to bring like-minded people together so we can network and collaborate and use each other's resources. So today I'm selling our merch that we use as just a way to get the brand out there, brand awareness and identity. So I have the t-shirts on hand and then we have online orders for the hoodies. Mm -hmm. And the shirts are looking fire. Yeah, I've yeah, seen a couple it. of people walking around That's with what it. Love right there. Mm -hmm. I love that. Okay. So... What does it feel like to have the opportunity to be here at Black Friday, to be selling some of your products, but also be in a room full of some amazing black entrepreneurs? Uh, it's great because, you know, there's not always a lot of opportunity for people to have visibility or a space to like operate in their business. Obviously, brick and mortar can be very expensive. So to have a place where you can actually bring people together, you can actually see the people, talk with the people. I think it's a lot it's very beneficial instead of just having to rely on online. Definitely, yeah. The whole brick and mortar situation can be difficult. So having these opportunities to have people come out, be vendors and sell their products, I think is super important for Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. So another question I want to ask you is, how do you try to stand out in a room full of entrepreneurs? Uh, that's a tough one because I'm kind of low key, but um, I think I mostly make the product speak for itself. Mm -hmm. um, besides that, I always make sure to, you know, make good eye contact don't be afraid to talk to people because you never know like sometimes selling is just having a good conversation they're like oh i like this guy what do you have so <laughs> a lot of times you know you just to be able to put yourself out there participate in the room and that's usually what works i mean i remember the first time we met too it was kind of like that same type of energy yeah. so i i second that i second yeah. that um another question i want to ask you is what is your biggest superpower when it comes to your business uh, my biggest superpower, I would say, would just be, I think, just my interpersonal skills. So being able mm -hmm. to talk with people, identify with things that people have been going through and just have like real conversations like we're having right now mm -hmm. and not being afraid to say hi or not being afraid to be vulnerable. I tell people the real. Yeah, it's just keep, keep it 100, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Yeah. Keep it 100. OK, one final question. It's a little bit of a curveball. What celebrity would you love to have dinner with? Ooh, that's a good one. I've been fortunate to speak with a lot of decent people. Um, a lot of people are gone. I don't know. It sounds sounds cliche, but maybe only person I could think of off the top of my head is maybe like Jay Z, just because <laughs> it's somebody that knows that next next level of business, but I think can still relate with the culture that I grew up in because I'm very rooted in hip-hop and stuff like that so mm. maybe being able to see it from his mind or perspective i think yeah. would be helpful i feel like chanel asked you the question like would you take the dinner with jay-z or five hundred thousand dollars but um i think we kind of know what that answer may be for sure no, i'll take the five hundred thousand <laughs> for sure that's part of being a uh, financial literate when you know what to do with money then you can see all the opportunities that capital can bring you so fair fair absolutely <laughs> okay one final thing i need yeah. you to do i just need you to look into that camera yeah. and tell people to follow all black markets Okay, make sure you follow All Black Market. Get tapped in. You want to be at this event if you missed it this time. A lot of things going on, and there's going to be a lot of stuff in the future. So stay tapped in in order to know what's going on. Mm, that's the word right there. Dale, thank you so much. Thank Appreciate you so your much, time, man. man. And I hope you enjoy yourself today. Yes, you too. All right.